we need to explain to her what we mean when we say we're going for a run. Hey yo viewers, back to another normal video this week where we run and do things. Uh, so, you know our friend uh, and faithful viewer Kunkel5 pointed out something in a post that maybe some of you other runners heard about, but a, an Olympic hopeful was disqualified because she blamed a burrito for having bad things in them and gave a bad test results. But, you know, I'm, I'm here to, to prove that burritos do not help you run well. Um, and to help prove this, we've flown in an expert on all things running. And uh, if you subscribe to this channel, you know who that is. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, Coach HJ. Yeah. Why am I still a slow runner? Why are you still a slow runner? Mm -hmm. um, because it's hot out. That's mm -hmm. when, you, when it's hot out, we slow it down. Mm -hmm. Now when you add a burrito into the mix, that is a little bit of protein. It does add a, a little bit of, of the fuel. But right before a run, maybe it weighs you down. Maybe it doesn't. But as, you know, as far as this Olympic runner is concerned, yeah, that's not... That's... There's pork in this burrito too. Oh yeah, see, good, mm -hmm. good, uh, good protein. Pork and beans. Probably better for really, after. Pork and bean burrito. Probably better for after. But so, yeah. how are we going to test this? Um, I think you should eat that whole thing, mm -hmm. and then do at least a mile. No warm up. Not, no not, stretching. Not expert. <laughs> <laughs> King, I think it was uh, uh, sig signifies your dedication to the channel that you would fly in HJ first class and. Put her up at a four-star hotel here in Abilene, all expenses paid. Wait, so. I missed that part. The first <laughs> last part. <laughs> so I think we have all the the slackers assembled here. But I think we're gonna take part of HJ's plan. We're gonna take this burrito and uh, see how much it can fuel us along this stretch of track. It's a little warm outside. Asphalt track. Great choice. This is not asphalt. It's Oh, that's that's better. Yeah. Black, black rubber. Though. Remember, okay. we ran yeah. here for the pollo paste. Pollo paste. Oh. All right, let's get to it. No, we have a 9 p.m. race. It's uh 9:29 in the a.m. right now. Mm -hmm. What's so. your a goal right now, H. J. for your burrito paste? My burrito paste? Actually, getting in a full mile. That's my a goal. Uh, I don't know if we're even gonna do that. You know how much time that is for me? 15 minutes. Um, it's Shay. I think you, I think you've come across something. MK just said, I don't think we can do that. You have just encountered slackers with limits. Slackers? Well, no. You still have unlimited potential. You just know your boundaries. Please help us untap that. Mm-hmm. Okay. You know, we just had Flag Day and Fourth of July is coming up. But here's another flag that's flying. It's your mask flag. Convid is over. Okay, so what's the science? Science. It's science. What are you doing? I'm just gonna run, and then I'm gonna eat this. Then run again? And then maybe run again. Just even see if my tum tum will let me. <laughs> okay, we're not gonna time anything because that's too much work. Yeah. And there's only so much work we're gonna put into this channel. Yeah. So we're gonna we're gonna do one lap. Whoever wants to do a lap. Some have already started eating. Eating is good. <laughs> <laughs> it is, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Will I get all the way around the track? Maybe. Maybe. Maybe Let's not. join HJ as she yeah. runs around right. the track. HJ already has a lap down. You're you're one lap in and you ate the burrito while you're traveling. How was that? I did. It was actually um, uh, an interesting concept because um, not only am I eating a burrito on a track in the heat and humidity of the storybook capital of the galaxy. Ooh. None of which I have got, gone We got through. upgraded. Upgrade. <laughs> <laughs> we'll have to change a lot of black. But yeah, that's but okay. that's okay. <laughs> yeah, none of which I've actually done before, all at once. It's good, Disney first. Mm-hmm. But you, never, nothing new on race day though, so. No. That's good. It's be a problem. Let's see what happens. This is race day, for this real. Is race day, it is for real. So far, so good. You're eating and running. You got running. Diet Coke in you. I do. It's like Jeff Galloway. Do you like Diet Coke? I think he runs with a coat. That's not well, that's confirmed. 
Uh, let me talk to someone who's actually talked to Jeff Galloway. HJ! HJ! I've actually talked to Jeff Galloway. Really? Yeah. Uh, At one of the expos I went and I introduced myself to him. HJ, do you have a podcast where you talk to Jeff Galloway? I talked karate dancing last night. Oh. Feeling it. Can you demonstrate a move? Oh yeah! Oh yeah! You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna take two bites of the burrito and force dump it to the other end end zone. Whoa. That's what I'm gonna do. Okay. Can you hold my burrito? Or should I just put it in my flip belt? I think you should put it in your flip belt. Okay. Uh, you know, before I do that, we had burritos and chimichangas in a other episode where we used it to foam roll link above and I also had it in my flip belt while I was running the dopey 10k mm -hmm. and then it defrosted and we had the finish line with the burrito in there mm -hmm. and uh but here's here's another use for things rolled in or tortilla it's a totally wrong way to say tortilla but is this your second burrito <laughs> okay there you go it's really good. good. Alright, so you're taking two bites, mm -hmm. putting in the flip belt, you're gonna mm -hmm. forest gump. Alright, there you go. Janae. Oh yeah, it's good technique. It actually fits in the flip belt. I may be done after this. You can go around with him. End zone to end zone. Oh, okay. Here we go. Here you go. I'm, this is how we do it in West Texas. We just put football fields everywhere. Yeah. If there are a hundred empty yards, transform it into a football field. That's how we do. It's hard to run on grass. Can't keep up. Dang, he's fast. Touchdown. Pretty. Yeah. Hundred yard dash. Yeah. Sheesh. All right. I can't breathe. Yeah. Nice blue sky here. Don't know it's on this grass. Oh, this dog pee or whatever. Oh, I'm totally lying down on my burrito. <laughs> <laughs> you were close. MK. Yeah. How's it going? It's going. It's going. Yeah. How much burrito have you eaten? Half of a burrito. Half of a burrito. I'm gonna eat some more burrito. These are very solidly constructed burritos. So, my whole body weight, convid fluffies and all, did not destroy it. Still good. Party burrito. Woo! I have some salsa. Hey, Wood. HJ's at 0.75 miles. I'm at like 0.25. You done with your burrito? I ate my burrito. There have not been any sports agents who have come and tried to convince me to be an Olympic contender. So, sorry lady, we have proven today that burritos do not make you faster. Sorry for the injustice you suffered. They did make me happy and full. So, when you departed my presence, the plan was to sprint back and forth from goalpost to goalpost. I noticed you stopped at one. Can you tell me more about that? I never said I was going back to the other one. Yeah, you did. No, I didn't. You I just did. said I was going to Forrest Gump it. And when Forrest Gump goes to the end zone, he usually <laughs> does not stop, <laughs> and he runs home to mama. Yeah. Hold the tape. <laughs> end zone to end zone. Oh, okay. As, as you notice, all, all five slackers are here, and Coach <laughs> H.J. is still running. Coach. Oh. Yeah, she is. Yeah. She ran a little bit. MK ran a little more. Yeah, you ran. You ran some. What was your distance? Uh, I did two laps. Two laps. About half a mile. Yes. So Coach HJ is over there running away, and I think we need to explain to her what we mean when we say we're going for a run. This, this is what it looks like. Is we might move for a little bit. Way to go, HJ! Then we end up. Yay! Like a gazelle. Well. Are you still going? Oh, this is my cool down. Cool down. <laughs> it doesn't look cool out you there. You guys had to stretch afterward? No, I don't know how. Cool. <laughs> so yeah, she doesn't understand what a run is. And 
slacker world that if you move a little bit, then you end up sitting on concrete eating a burrito. We need caffeine. There's water, I need water. I need to get water and I have a noon thingy, but it's not my noon with caffeine. I need some more salsa. Started. Uh, HA, yeah. you did about a one and a quarter mile one and a quarter. of burrito paste yeah. euphoria. Mm -hmm. How was it? Actually, the burrito may have mitigated the heat humidity disadvantage. Mm -hmm. oh. and coupled with the altitude advantage, mm -hmm. I may have actually done, well, yeah, I mean, considering my pace, yeah, it's about what I do at home. <laughs> Out. That's good. It all kind of evens itself out. So you have a race tonight. Uh huh. Five miles. Uh huh. How how are you gonna tackle that? Uh, one mile at a time. One mile at a time. One mile at a time. Take that one step at a time. Yep. I think there's snacks every mile. Oh, what so if, that's what, good. What if one mile at a time is just too many miles at a time? What do you suggest? Well, this race has a five miler, a three hour. -er, yeah. and a six hour -er. so as i picked up my packet yesterday i was like so i have six hours to complete five miles huh? <laughs> and there was there was there was no pushback on that you know i was thinking about like the one mile at a time seems too long there was a time in my training where i used to think of marathons as oh just four 10ks plus a couple extra miles that's not hard 10ks are hard now 10ks are the new half marathon that's that's where we are post COVID. Breaking a sweat, running 100 yards. Breaking a sweat, sitting here eating a burrito. <clears throat> now you're a tree fly. <clears throat> I didn't warm up. I didn't warm up. I think I'm a cake How do you warm up? What's a warm up? <laughs> what is that? What does that look like? Can you show us? Uh, her, her warm up is what we do most Saturday. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the entire right. time. <laughs> Take our entire Slacker Saturday run, and that's probably how she warms up. Okay. You remember what I told you to bring to hang out with the Slackers? A oh, smile? Stretchy pants. Stretchy pants. Which, I, that's and all I have. And a lightsaber. That's all I have. <laughs> What's going on here, guys? Go, go, go. So run? I got go. a drink in my hand. Well, so do I. All right, you guys go. Good job, guys. Good job. Good job, guys. I'll keep up with you. Yeah. Look at them go. There's J. Crow leading the pack. Keeping up your coarse cutting ways. <laughs> oh, ho, ho, ho. Great form, great form. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> this would be the extent of my track coaching capability. <laughs> uh, Jez. Yes. Do burritos make you faster? Sure do. Hey! Disqualified from the Olympics. <laughs> oh man. Your second lap was faster? My second lap was faster, but am I gonna continue running? Absolutely not. I did about half a mile ish. Done a half a mile total yeah, today. That's, that's good. Uh, oh, yeah, next I guess question. I'm going to three quarters. I walked. Do burritos make you feel more nauseous when you're running? It's not a nauseated feeling, it's more of like, oh, it's gonna come up and a little full. But I need some coffee now, which I have not had. Comes um, you want to get? Do burritos make you faster? Yes. It did? Oh, yeah. disqualified. Disqualified. Yeah. Your spot goes to me now. Uh-oh. It was good. I mean, I really don't have any fuel in my stomach. I'm not a breakfast person, so. Oh, what? MK, huh. <laughs> did a burrito help your running? I think the first half might have. The second half did not. All right, not disqualified. Oh, thank you. That's how you stretch. What's oh, happening? look, What's oh. stretching. That's how you stretch. Hey guys, this is stretching. Oh, see. I don't know if I can do that. Let's see. <laughs> no, you have to straighten your leg, Jared. You don't have to. <laughs> Wait, what was the other pose you were doing? Let's see if Jared can do that. Okay, I want to see if you can do that. You're not trying HJ's pose. But then stick your leg out. Oh, are you sure? Very nice. Yeah. How's that feel? <laughs> <laughs> what would it be like to do burrito burpees? Burrito burpees? Who can do a burrito burpee? Burrito burpee. There are there are some things we won't do on the channel, but eventually we will do a burrito burpee. I was just gonna say I'd do it. Yeah. We did Topo Chico burpees one episode. We did. 
All right, another example why Convit is over. Just Taking a burrito off of the ground in a wrapper. Paper, but yeah, it took it good. off the ground. I'm gonna try burrito burpees. I'm gonna educate your literal tens of viewers on how to do a burrito burpee. The first thing is you need a lot of extra room. Yeah. Because it's not normal burpees. This is sausage, e sausage, egg, and cheese version. Oh, is it? Yeah. Cool. Okay, but what? that's okay. We'll be fine. Uh, so the next. What's gross about sausage, egg, and cheese? I just before like, we move on. It's not. I wanted potato, egg, and cheese. Oh, sausage. What's wrong with sausage? You know, nothing but potatoes are better. The food of my people. Uh, place burrito on the ground. Uh, I guess I think I'm convict over, guys. So, get ready for a burpee. Jump up, down. <laughs> oh! Can you bring my robber back? <laughs> <laughs> That's the risks you take. <laughs> one more, one more. I haven't stopped chewing the first bite. <laughs> <laughs> Not bad. Okay, now give give us a review of that. It's altogether more enjoyable than a normal burpee. Yeah, because there's a reward at the end. Yeah. If yeah, if I had some kind of burrito or some kind of treat. Yes, I'm like a dog or a horse. Mm -hmm. I'll be more inclined to do that. Yeah, you put Reese's peanut butter cups at the floor of a burpee. I'm going to do I'm some more do burpees. It. Now, although I'm a little disheartened because oh, I'm moving. I'm disheartened because at the beginning I was sure. Is that potato in there or is there sausage in there? It's sausage. Okay. I was sure that burritos had a negative effect on your training and I was gonna side with that lady and be like she should not have been disqualified so in retrospect I did do a faster second lap disqualified and the burpee was fun so sorry Kunkel slacker method is not Olympic approved but uh, we have proven that burritos are fun mm -hmm. burritos are nutritious and we have proven that HJ really didn't understand how much we slack. I, I stand by my uh, claims that the burritos will soon be on the IOC banned substance list because they do in fact enhance performance. Your burpee proved it. Also, I saw a moment of indecision where you weren't sure if you should put the burrito on the track or not. I'm going to stop eating it now because starting at this line, Here's where I grabbed it with my hand Straight that was on the, the track. Rubber track. Yeah. Probably a good idea, even though the convent is over. It's over. Yeah. All right, guys. I think that was a good scientific experiment um, on yeah, physical yeah. education. Uh, we're going to get this on the emergency FDA disapproval IOC thing um, so it could be used and all those things like that. Why are you smelling the water? Because it's a cola flavored oh, okay. noon. I was like, what's wrong with the water? Courtesy of <laughs> HJ. Well, it, it's getting higher in the bottle. Yeah. It's happens. like a volcano. That's why you don't run with it, right? Yeah. <laughs> I'm not running anymore until tonight. So, um, thank you for flying in and giving us some great guidance you for bet. this. You bet, and thank um, you for having me because this, um, the, the trip down was Luxurious. And From first class. Beautiful. It was the greatest was accommodations. Very, very you had food, nicely food generous. In yeah. your airplane. Yeah. <laughs> Private slacker flight. Yeah, it yeah. was, uh, you know, it was all, grapes. All the and Cheetos you can eat. Cheese and <laughs> sausage. And, yeah. yeah it was, it was, it, pretzel crisps. Yeah. It was, it was good. That's good. Did you listen to any podcasts on I the way? I listened to nothing but micro on the way down. Oh, okay. Micro, the Dirty way Dirty jobs. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Good. Any any last words for our class? Yeah, Close out this episode. Nothing really. I think um, you know your results may vary mm -hmm. with the burrito, you know, the burrito pace and all of that stuff. But uh, I think all I gotta say is you know like, subscribe, and tell your mom about this.